G'day everyone, Josie here again, um, bringing you the next video of the Rollercoaster Tycoon 3 Soaked campaign. Uh, so it looks like we're a third of the way there already. Um, yeah, so let's, no point beating around the bush, let's get straight into it. So, um, yeah, not quite sure how the last one has gone yet, as um, as I said in the first video, I'm recording these in a pretty short amount of time. I'm hoping to, I'll probably release them all um, pretty close together, so I'll have a backlog of videos to upload. Um, but yeah, here we go, Monster Lake. Uh, Rumours of something lurking beneath the surface of the Monster Lake have sc scared up interest in this water park. Get your teeth into the competition and unleash a monster park on the unsuspecting peeps. So, I need 300 guests in the park, two coasters um, of 160 meters, total ride monthly income of $800. I need 600 guests in the park, I need a park rating of 800 to be sustained for at least three months, and then a swimming pool, Bob Waterman, which is quite aptly named there. Mr. Waterman. Um, so minimum length of 160. Let's have a look at this one. It's uh, 400, 500 meters. So, oh, and it's only a dollar. I need to crank that right up. I think I can get it even higher than that. I'll make that eight dollars for now until guests complain. So I've already made one coaster. Um, now I just need to get guests in the park really um, and start building rides to get some profit. So, looks like we've got a decent amount of space here to work with. Um, I'm not quite sure where the, the entrance to the park is. Okay. So are they all, these are all linked, are they one ride? Yep, they're all one ride, okay. $2.62. Sweet. Um, but it looks like that's the only way to get over to this island here, which um, isn't great cause, because that means, yeah, I don't really like that. So I'm going to build a footpath that goes all the way over to there. Yep, that'll be the first thing I do. So, what I will do is I'll build a path. I'm not sure what path they're using here. Oh yeah, just the generic path. Um, bring it straight up here. Uh, looks like that's what the game wanted anyway. Judging by the um, the thunder is really um, going to town there. So I'll delete that. This is going to be a very expensive venture here. Um, I don't need to repay my loan so I can turn that all the way up. bring my footpaths all the way over here. Whoops. Um, yep. Ah. case that
There we go. Now, I was just about to say, I think what happens now is that the water transport now gets blocked off. So, I think I'll need to put some scenery underneath just to make it easier for them to get under. Um, I might not use that one, I might use. Um, Spooky wooden house. I don't think it's going to matter either way. I'll just try and keep it um, within the theme of the game. So, I just need a floor tile. There we go. A walkway. That'll do. And did that work? Yep. Yeah. What I fear now, though, is that it's all well and good that that's under that there's a space there, but um, it doesn't mean that they will go underneath it. So that could be a bit of an issue. We'll soon find out. Ah, there we go. It did work. Perfect. So that fixed that issue. Um, yep, now to get to building, I suppose. Uh, what I was thinking of was building one of these. And how long are some of these? 190. Pretty much all I need um, to fulfill this objective. That's um, oh, we've got a challenge here. Man, that thunder is loud. Um, the God Sensation, the Brotherhood of Apocalyptic Unpleasantness, is in town for a constant two months. If our park contains four attractions that are suitable for old style and time, we'll attract loads of angst-ridden teenagers. Okay. Um, I will accept that. Spooky theme, yes. Um, even though I have been quite terrible at completing those objectives so far, find out now. So, spooky. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Uh, okay. It's going to do that to me. If I just bring it up, all up to this level, then that should work. Shouldn't have any mucking around. what I wanted to see. I don't think I have any, um, they have any specifically spooky um, scenery for this in this game. delete some of this. That's okay. There we go. Open. 285, not the most exciting ride that this park will see, but it does its job. And hopefully that is that objective done. Yes, it is. Awesome. And it may have also checked out that one. No, it didn't. Okay, that's fine. Um, I'll put those in here. Hopefully we get some spooky rides. Oh, awesome. All of these rides are spooky. So, 
that makes this a hell of a lot easier to do, to complete. So I'll put that there. I'll use my spooky. Use that. Bring it up to 350. And I'll put the mirror maze in behind as well. Oh, what now? See how this goes now. Thank you. Don't know why that was such an issue. And there we go. in spooky hedges instead Okay, so I just added some more spooky, um, spooky theme hedges around the outside there. Um, I don't think that's going to be enough though. Add in some more. There we go. One tree did it. Was that the challenge or was that the... Yes, okay, that was the challenge and the objective at the same time. Sweet. So, now i just got to start getting those monthly ride incomes up. Um, I actually think that looks really good anyway. The, um... Oh, like, look at that. Yeah, I like the look of this, um this area of the park anyway um, I might try and change the landscape and see if that what if I use that not sure if that looks spooky or not no, not spooky enough that'll do so we've got our spooky section there just change the names to clean it up this house Right, now let's see our profits. So, it doesn't look like we need all that too much more rides here. Um, but I'll add in some anyway, and luckily they don't need to be spooky themed. Oh, I didn't really hope that, that wouldn't delete the hedges. But that's okay. with that, uh, I'll add that, add in this, because I actually didn't mind the, um, how those hedges looked, this is actually looking like probably one of the best 
scenery parks. No. Best scenery parks I've built to date. Um, I think that challenge had most to do with it, really. Um, I'm just going to turn the sound down a bit. There we go, that's better. Because that thunder was uh, extremely noisy. Sweet. So I'll open that up. Spiral slide. I'm going to call this Slippery Dip. I'm not quite sure what it's called um, elsewhere, but um, yeah, that's what it's. It's what I used to. It used to be called around here um, in Australia, or where I grew up anyway. Okay, so I hope I spelled that right. Open that up. No, I don't want to write it. I've wrote a million of those in my life. Uh, turn that up. Turn this up. I know people enjoy uh, this ride. Crank that up. Uh, now I'll just fix the hedges, I suppose. Uh, yeah. Small hedge. So by the looks of it, when this park got built, um, some of the paths, I mean some of the hedges were built on this side and some were built on this side which would get deleted. Oh, must be. Uh, not quite sure why those got deleted then. Uh, throw a few flowers in there. Flowers in there. get a small hedge, put the small hedge in there, just to outline the gardens, I think that makes it look a little bit cleaner, um, I'll also add in a few trees just to, to round it out, um, large Douglas fir, Sweet. And that is done. Now, let's see how our rides are going. Oh, we may get there this month to the 800 mark. Um, yeah, so I'm pretty confident that I'll that we'll get there this time. Um, yep. So, um, guest rating. Let's have a look. We're at 770, so there's a decent amount of litter and vomit, understandable. Um, so, let's have a look at these guys. Awesome. Um, I'm going to change all the rides, actually I'll change the important rides to 10 minute um, every 10 minutes to get fixed if I can remember how that goes, there we go right there so I'll call one of the mechanics over to fix it or to inspect it and I'll also inspect this one every 10 minutes just because you want the high the high priority rides um, yeah, making your money constantly. So, um, to keep the park rating higher, we'll also need some handymen. I mean, some janitors to keep the litter down. Um, sweet. So, the litter, oh, there we go, oh, I was right, we managed to get there. Now, I've got to hold 800 for 
three months, which sounds easy enough, but I also need to have a pool um, complex here. So I just spotted this area is a nice flat bit of ground um, to build a pool. So I'll start building the pool now. Um, and yeah, I'll get back to you guys once that is complete. There we go. So I have just completed my pool. Um, I'm looking to finish that objective with the um, yeah, with our special guest. Um, looks like litter and vomit is still causing issues around the park. Um, I'll try and find the main area of litter and vomit. Yeah, I'll try and find, I'm assuming it's up here, near this rod, maybe? No? Nope. Um, well, I am quite confused as to where this 50, negative 50 litter and vomit um, is coming from. So, yeah, I need to get that, that rating up before I can... Um, yeah, complete this objective. So, I can't see why he wouldn't be able to go to the pool. Um, yeah, it looks like I clicked on a random person. Uh, it looks like the hardest part here will be getting my park rating up. So, what I'm going to do is make sure all my staff are well trained and paid well just so they're as productive as possible so I'll train them up 
try it here. Try it here. And try it here. And I'll give them all raises. So hopefully, fingers crossed, um, that will help. Um, yeah, clean up the park, make it a little bit better. Um, get rid of that raining. So, I now realise that I don't have any shops around the park, so I'm going to quickly build those in now. I'll come back to you guys once it's done, once again. Righto, so I've um, added in some extra bins and um, I've added just two stools. I don't know if that's going to be enough. Um, I might add two more up this side of the park because uh, this is where I'll probably start building again, um, more rides. So I'll put in another um, burgers just right next to the change room there. And another spooky shakes. And I'll also add a toilet right there. Open that up. Just keep them all together. Um, yep. So, let's see how my park range is going now. 754. Still a lot of vomit. Um, a lot of vomit in the park. Which, um... Yeah, it does not help our cause here at all. Um, so, yeah, that's not, not helping. Um, but what I will do in the meantime is just keep, just keep building rides, trying to keep that park rating up as best as I can. Um, yeah. Yeah, there's not much else I can do other than keep going until Okay, I'll I'll do that. I'll also add in some pumpkin pies. And I'll see if I can I'll also close down the burgers so that pumpkin pies is the only food that can be bought in the park for now. So I will also add another one of these in at this key choke point here. There. And I'll open that up. Perfect. Now, let's see if my guests have... I, st I, st I don't know where this, I honestly don't know where that 72 vomit is coming from because that seems to be the only thing that is holding me up um, at the moment from getting my my park rating. Oh, there we go. I found some on the staircase here. I think. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yes, yeah, so there is. I just had to zoom in a bit further. So... What I'm going to do is I'm going to get one of my handymen. I'm going to drop him here. I'm also going to set his area for just in here. 
so hopefully he goes through cleaning up all this area um, yeah and it should hopefully um, yeah increase my park rating and just keep this area tidy so if he's not constantly running around everywhere all over the park which I'm assuming has happened um, yeah he can just stay here clean all this up yeah so it doesn't look like it becomes an issue past here it's more an issue just back where the ride was um, yeah which is fine so there he is he's already cleaned it up we'll see if um, yep so the ratings going down we finally hit 800 so um, I just have to sustain that now for as long as I can uh, yep so I'll grab this guy as well and I'll send help over here uh, no I want to put him there yep he should go through travel down and pick up all that lit uh, that vomit going down that way perfect so let's have a look at our rating see if it's getting any better 801 still uh, I'd like to get it up a bit higher to give us a bit of a threshold um, so we're not won't get too caught out um, if something bad does happen so I've got this ferris wheel and I think I'm going to put it I want to put it here like overlooking the park sort of thing um, and it looks like it's been perfectly made for us to do that as well so oh and the paths fit perfectly so I'll open that up 215 so in that 210 that'll do um, yep I'll add that bin back that I deleted and oh we got skulls as well as pumpkins I wish I knew that earlier I would have preferred to put the skulls around they look a bit nicer than the pumpkin ones but that's okay so let's have a look now 856 that's what that's what we're looking for we need a rating like that to keep us to keep us afloat um, so um, yeah I think that's pretty good for now I may as well just start speeding it up um, to finish this objective a bit faster um, not quite sure where the entrance is to this park I, I think it's I think it's under here but I'm going to add a information kiosk right here um, just for umbrellas because it looks like this park has a ridiculous amount of ridiculous amount of rain so um, yeah make people um, oh and we just got um, our pumpkin challenge done as well um, Perfect. So with that money, I'm definitely going to build another roller coaster, um, as that'll keep our both our rating up as well as giving us another. Oh, you're joking. Um, I just wanted to build a nice, cheap, small. small ride but um looks like that might prove more difficult than I originally thought so what I might do here is I'll check out how much land I own actually I think I own it out to oh I own it all the way out to here so I've got a lot of space to build a roller coaster actually 
but what I will do is just make a flat just flatten out an area here where I can start the ride um, I'm not sure I'm not sure which one I want to build yet I might build a hang on this one might do if it decides to load yep There we go. Got a flying turns ride. Now, hopefully. Oh, I thought I might have got away with it. No, not quite. Need to flatten that out. There we go. do that too far over or else I might wreck the path um, see if I can bring that footpath up no what about this way perfect great 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 so now I can run this all the way around no not that far around all the way around like that and that can connect all the way in Perfect. So I'll open that up. Uh, one second. Can't add more than one. Okay, that that's fine. Uh, five point five nine. So we'll get uh, throw that money up. Sweet. Um, hit play. We're back to it. Perfect. So our our rating is still um, plenty high enough to to complete the objective. Um, so yeah, I'll just I suppose we'll just wait it out now, uh, making sure that the park is yeah satisfactory to finish that last objective. So it's just a waiting game now. I'll just let it let it ride out, I suppose. I'll see you guys either when this objective is finished or when I need to change something else. And there we have it. We have uh, officially finished the park there. Um, I know that was a bit of cheating there at the end to get that um, that roller coaster in. I probably should have just built my own. Um, but for the sake of the length of this video, I thought I'd just throw one in to finish it off. Oh, that's right. I forgot everyone um, throws their balloons up once you complete an objective. <laughs> um, yeah, cool. So, hope you guys like this video. Um, I'll see you next time for the um, next one. Cool. See you then.